Hey guys, Josh Kell here with more Twilight Princess. Okay, so I've just signed, kind of warped up to the Zora's domain. Last time I had trouble with the pose, if you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, no, but so we we already talked to the guys in town, and they told us as she was up here in the mountains. Well, this red dot on the map tells me that this is the way to the mountains. And why is Link climbing a mountain? Well, because they told me to, and Link's very impressionable. <laughs> So here she is, here, in her, like, weird-ass yeti coat. <laughs> How do I get one of those? Snow Peak. So I was just thinking, I, I, I do a lot of that, don't I? <laughs> oh, I'll tell you after this. <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> I love how they just begin with that. Like, it makes them so, like, there's such a serious tone. <laughs> what brings you to a dangerous place like this? Ever since Zora's domain got covered in ice, this mountain's been much colder than usual, yeah? Not only that, but I heard a really weird story from the Zoras. Apparently, the beast that lives somewhere in this mountain has been seen frequently in Zora's domain. I was curious, so I came and waited, and as they said, a, a giant appeared. Whoa, that's, um, interesting. Yeah, it looked like this. Whoa, whoa, okay. Are you telling me it looked like a piece of paper? <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I, I don't think you can actually see it, but it, it, this hastily drawn picture shows a creature as she saw holding a red fish. So I guess other people can see it, but we can't. <laughs> Apparently this thing's been stealing red fish from the village. Ah, damn, those are our red fish. I want to investigate further, but I can't even see the path through this blizzard, yeah? I'm sure you're here because you're curious about the mountain, but you best not go about a plan. Screw the plan. No, okay, we better get a plan. Cause um, actually, I should show this off. So if you try to, well, first of all, you can't touch this lake part because you get frozen, and that would be not good. Good thing Link jumps automatically, even though it's not like, it's not much of a ledge, so you wouldn't think he would, but he does. He's a he's a smart little guy, or medium sized guy, or whatever the hell height he is. So anyway, if I try to go over here. Well, first of all, I'll start doing the Iron Boots dance, because I can't, like, can't roll, can't do anything. You can stab to move slightly faster. Hey, it's like that, um, like being on the Iron Boots walls. <laughs> Man, did I, did I talk about that, um, exploit you can do with that? I'm sure I mentioned that once. There's, like, this ex exploit, where if you, like, take the Iron Boots off, you can walk at normal speed on those. Alright, what's Minda got to say? She's been bugging me for a bit. What a terrible spawn looks like. What a mirror is hidden somewhere, but we need a plan. We need a plan. No, screw the plan. Yeah, we gotta find the beast. Show the sketch. Alright, um, well, I wanna. Alright, well, I'm doing this the stupid way. So you turn to wolf, the snow, like, doesn't affect you. Because wolves have plus one snow defense, obviously. So anyway, if I try to go over here, you get, like, warped back to here, which doesn't really make much sense, but, you know, you know, it's, can we, um, how do you actually, oh, sorry, up here, <laughs> this is how you get up, you know, it's just like Ocarina of Time, you know, where in that Gerudo Desert, you know, just like Ocarina of Time, you know, if I've ever had a counter for an LP, this one should have a just like Ocarina of Time counter, or, or should have had one anyway, <laughs> uh, Oh, oh, right, she's, no, I, well, I don't, she's not trying to tell me something, she, I'm pressing up, oh, I've, I had a feeling, I had a feeling, oh, oh, what's this? Alright, no, it's just gonna disconnect again, I'm just wasting time here, I, I, I did get more batteries, so this isn't a problem, so I'll just change those, <laughs> stupid ass. But the thing is, it's, like, working, it's not working, like, how does that work? I can swing it and it works, but it's, like, I can't, up where it works, Man, Wii Motes are weird. Alright, there we go. Brand new batteries that have never been put in anything before. Man, secondhand batteries. That's a weird concept. Okay, stop, stop like, screwing around over here, okay? And we need to... Um... We need to show... This piece of paper to... What's-his-face? Now, what, what's-his-face is in here. Prince Ralts. Ralts. What, whatever it's spelled, I can't remember, it's been too long. So we need to hop over to Kakariko and show him this. Now remember to de-wolf. 
So where is he hanging out? Is he still hanging out at the graveyard? Uh, I think so. Like, where else would he be? Yeah, he's definitely at the graveyard. Um, Over here, over here, over here. <laughs> Man, you can tell it's been a while, you know? I mentioned this, like, the other episode, but... Damn, you know, I really wish this LP hasn't been going on for, like, half a year at this point, because... I've forgotten so many things, and Twilight Princess is definitely, like, a game you should be doing more than two episodes a week of, but, man, whatever, right? We're, we're getting it done. We're slowly getting it there. You know, it all... I, I almost hate to, um, go, go through this whole... I almost hate to increase it to more than two episodes a week, because that's all we've been doing for, like, six months, and for some dumb reason, I kind of like to keep it like that, even though that's, like, super redundant. There he is. Yeah, I was hoping we weren't wasting our time coming over here. You know, for we, the water actually looks pretty nice. Nice, I must say. <laughs> is is your name asshole? My mother came to me in a dream. She showed me your image. Wait, we, we haven't talked to him yet, have we? Uh, yeah, he hasn't talked. <laughs> she spoke of a youth who would save our domain and steal my fate. One named asshole. That's a great name. <laughs> I must thank you for all you've done. If there's anything I ever do, please tell me, please. Oh man, he just really wants to help. All right. Hey, actually, press the right button. <laughs> Well, I've got this sketch, which, um, no effect, so link plus paper equals nothing. Alright, what about you? <laughs> hmm, the beast man of the snowy mountain, perhaps? But more important, this is a, is this red fish it is holding? Yes. <laughs> It must be a reek fish. That's a rare specimen found only in the Zora village, and that's why it's really easy to fish up. <laughs> it feeds on the valuable type of coral, and without a bait, even our best fishes cannot catch one. Look closely, asshole. My earring is made of this coral. I would like to give it to you. Ah, uh, excellent. Now, remember a long time ago, in part like 30-something, during the fishing stuff, I mentioned we couldn't get the sinking lure until we got an upgrade? Here is the upgrade. We can now go back and get the sinking lure. If we want, we probably won't do that until like after this temple because I'm sick of side quests right now. I received it from my mother. But it is fine. I no longer need it. As I look at you, I get a sense of what my mother wanted. What I should be doing now. Ah, uh, I, I shall call you Colin version 2. <laughs> I will return to my village. The reef fiction can be found in the mother and child rocks in my in, in the waterfall basin near my mother. Are they intentionally referencing Wind Waker or is this like you know... It's just a coincidence. <laughs> Alright, but that's, um... I kind of like that. You know, every minor character, you know, they may be pretty minor. Like, he's pretty minor. But at least he gets a nice, you know, resolved character arc. Now I can... Now he can see me here. Alright, we'll, we'll crawl through that hole. <laughs> Something just really funny about Adult Link, like, crawling through a hole. I don't know, it's like... <laughs> This is the first game Adult Link can, well, 3D one anyway, he can do it in, right? Because, um, you couldn't do it in Ocarina of Time. And you couldn't do it, well, Wind Waker, you, could, you were only a kid. So, yeah, um, uh, back to the Zora's Domain. Okay, though. Well, that is not the right way. Huh, I guess, I guess the Queen sat on that throne. And, uh, we're never gonna see it, you know. Well, actually, well, the Prince can sit there now, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Ugh, it's it's a touchy subject. Even even it's though it's a video game, it's still like a touchy subject, you know? Like, like you feel for him. Like you, you lost his mother, and that's no good. Oh, well, I suppose that's just the power of video games, you know? All right, all right. Now, enough farting around. Let's you know get that all important fishing rod out. Where is it? There it is. You can actually see. Yeah, plus earring. You can't detach the earring, so it's always. Like, you know, you can't minus earrings. So here's that mother and child rock. And you see it right there. It's a red reek fish. Okay. How about a little nibble? It shouldn't take long at all. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. Come on, take the... Alright, I think I might have to move it. Oh, I thought that was like a giant fish. Oh, well. That sort of worked for a bit there. Fishing, you know, I always wondered, like, why, why the heck is fishing in Legend of Zelda? Because it's not actually that bad in this game. Like, like I said, in the fishing part, it's definitely greatly improved in this game over Ocarina of Time. 
And because in Ocarina of Time, it's definitely like you have to wait a while. In this game, you don't have to wait too long. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Go a bit. Like. Oh, man. There we go. Gotcha. Some really. Like. This. You just. Oh, it, <laughs> compared to, you know, the whole jerking of the nun shark, just holding the Wii remote up here is kind of weird for this normal fishing stuff. Alright. So, what was the point of that? All we did was get a smelly fish out. Hmm. Smelly fish. Looks like it's time for some sniffing. Forget the pose scent. Yeah, I really don't need to know what the pose smell like. But is Reek fish any better? That that is the question. Oh, actually, this is a. It's a good thing it's becoming night right now because there's a lot of pose on the ascent, and I'm. I can outright guarantee we will miss miss a couple because they're you know it's it's snow it's white you can barely see them and it's almost impossible to tell if it's actually daytime or nighttime while you're there so you don't even know you know if <laughs> this is probably like oh by the way before I completely forget remember how at the start of this episode I was like I just realized something because I was thinking what I was thinking about is. You know, these, these last couple of dungeons, the the trip to get them is, like, just as fun. Well, maybe not one other, like, the last one. <laughs> but the, the trip to get to them is just as fun as the dungeon itself, which is definitely how it should be now. Activate sense. So now we can, you know, follow the, I mean, the... <laughs> I didn't even say it. <laughs> I was going to say, you know, we're going to follow the invisible Poe of our lens of truth because sensing is like this game's lens of truth. Well, actually, totally is when you think about it. Whoa, whoa, yeah, see, look at that. I, I, I almost completely missed that, and I guess it's night time now. Hey, what do you mean? As if I missed that, hey. Come on. All right, don't miss again. Gee, that would, that'd be pretty bad. Come on, Link, you need to practice your dog jumping aiming skills yeah, you can like, you can barely see anything and of course when you've got sense on you can barely see in front of you so uh yeah it's hope well I'm def like I said I'm definitely am going to miss something I just don't know what it is all right what's um over here because we can oh there's there's another one see, they're freaking everywhere all right there are what's can I just like walk down here yeah that's good okay oh and you can see there's a dig spot here too that's yeah, that's sort of what the pose here for. It's like it's like in the desert too. The pose signified dig spots, and this that's what this pose is doing here. All right, well, you we may as well again. We may as well see what's in here. It's probably nothing, and if it isn't nothing, it's whoa. Well, I'll tell you what it is. It's nothing I can do because we don't have the item to get through these giant ice chunks. Spoilers, spoilers, guys. We're gonna get it soon. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. <laughs> That's kind of obvious though, isn't it? Like, oh, you can see, is that another Poe up there? It totally is. Oh, no, I think that might be Ice Wolves. So it's like, do I even need to sense? Like, you can see clearly where you need to go at this point. But I think it does get a bit foggy again later, so. All right, no, nothing, nothing over that way. So yeah, you can see where we need to go on like the mini map. Oh, he, go, he goes like up there, huh? <laughs> well, that was not a dig spot. That was just a, all right, where am I? Okay, so you can sort of tell it's night. I'd tell a lie. Um, okay, I just fell down. <laughs> well, it didn't look like there was anything up there. Because there's also a... Um... As if there's nothing over here. Oh, it doesn't look like there is. Yeah, because there's also a, um... A howling stone. Oh, okay, you did need to go. Yeah, we did need to go over here, okay. Isn't there a Poe, like, over here, though? I swear there's a Poe over here. Oh, yeah, it's right there. Yeah, it's hiding in the tree. Just look at this. It's like the Poe horde. They're all here. They're all just having... They're chilling out. Pun intended. Pun intended indeed. <laughs> and there's another dig spot at this tree. Will I actually be able to do anything at this one? Let's find out after it loads. Ah, uh, oh, yes, we will. Lots of ice keys. Is that what they're called? Ice keys? They should be called, um... Frost... Bad. Yeah, actually, I don't... I don't have nothing. I guess... Frost keys is good enough, or ice keys, or... 
bat. <laughs> just call it bat. Or what about bat enemy? Oh, 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 I saw that. I saw that. What was that? There are rocks in here, and I want to find out what's behind the rocks. Let's blow it up. Could have... Oh, oh, what it? Hang on, hang on, hang on. That's... That's not gold. Or is it? And well, let's find out. Let's, um, equip... Oh, do I do have an empty bottle. Huh, how convenient. Alright, let's equip that. Oh, yeah, that's gold. It's just really shiny. Alright, what we got here? You have rare air. That's, that was gold. Just didn't look like it. Replenish all hearts and... Yes, yeah, so it's exactly the same as fairy tears, so... Who to knew, like, a special formula, like, you know, the best thing in the game could just be replicated by some enemy. <laughs> gotta really put that guy in, um... Ooh, gotta re-wolf. Human Link can't do anything here. Yeah, it, was, uh, it really put that Wind Waker guy out of business, because it's so easy. You know, you just kill a power, you scoop it up. You don't have to bring 20 stupid things to a guy to get a thing, which you don't even need to do because everything has exploding hearts and stuff in that game, so it's kind of redundant. Ram. So I, I like that. It's the mini puzzle, you know, hmm. This is real life, or or it's not, but either way. <laughs> so how in real life would I get snow down? You ram it. <laughs> it's like a door of the explorer solution. <laughs> Uh, yeah, there, there it is. There's that howling stone. We wouldn't, we wouldn't miss you. And we actually do need to go this way. Now, there's no... Well, we already found, like, three. I can't imagine there are that many more. Well, actually, I know where a couple are, but that's besides the point. Alright, let's do this. Alright, I can't remember. Let's cheat. I feel so dirty doing this, but at the same time, it's like, how dare you make this so- Oh, I'm, man, I screwed that up. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think that'd count. <laughs> it's like, how dare you making this so complicated in the first place? Okay, looks like- Yeah, see, my cheating screwed me up, because I've missed, like- Yeah, it's up top, see, I missed that, and it's like, yeah. So I, sh I should do this legit. That serves me right, eh? I'm just wasting time howling. There we go. Yeah, as I was saying, though, it's like, um, how in Majora's Mask, that you gotta, like, memorize that one song in the Zora place. Like, screw that. That's so tedious. Of course, you could have just played the game enough times to fully memorize the song, but I doubt that's gonna happen. No, I keep, I keep, like, pressing up to make it go up, but you've just gotta release it to bring it to the middle. No, I'll count it anyway. Whatever. Again, I'm really not sure about that one, but I was like, for some reason, like, I don't actually think it sounds like this, but I do remember one of them is supposed to be Dragon Roost Island, and I think that might be it, but <laughs> to me, that didn't sound anything like Dragon Roost Island, and look, he's right over there, where we just talked to Prince Charming, or whatever the hell you want to call him. Oh, I mean, I thought that tree was like the hero shade, I'm like, what is he doing here? It's just a tree. You're paranoid, man. Alright, now, isn't there like a... Yeah, yeah, it's like right here. That's where you actually need to go. So before we go the way we actually need to go... Is there any... You know, do I miss any pose? It's like a quick... Oh, whatever. <laughs> no, I think... I think there was only the three in this area, so... We should be able to just, um... Yeah, yeah. Uh, that must be it. Like, unless... Unless I missed, like, one that was, like, super secretly hidden. I don't think we missed anything. Okay. So, uh, this, this leads to a cave. Have a guess. <laughs> or, you could have guessed, or, or something. 
Man, I was really hoping we'd be able to get to something this part because I, I was like screwing around too much or whatever. <laughs> We've run out of time, unfortunately. Ah, oh well. No, actually, oh, this cave is short. Okay, we'll get through this cave so, like, I can cliffhang it properly so you, can, you guys can see it and be like, damn, I want to see what that's all about. Because <laughs> I'm, I am the ultimate teasing cliffhanger LPing arsehole. Like, if I see cliffhang potential, I cliffhang it. Nah. <laughs> if I had it, if, like, that is indeed a blue rupee. If, if, if I had it, like, you know, the perfect... Scenario, I wouldn't cliffhang at all. I just like do a complete, you know, run through in a perfect world where there was no such thing as upload time and attention spans, and you know, YouTube actually properly remembered where you were. Because <laughs> this, is, this is a super minor complaint, but like the other like, a while ago, I don't remember exactly when it was. Hey, get up there. So we'll have to come back here later to destroy some of these giant ice chunks we've been seeing. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, before we end up, minor complaint about YouTube. So, a while back, I remember I started watching something on my PC, then I switched over to my 3DS, and then YouTube actually remembered where, you know, it started the video at the time code, which is, I thought, man, that's freaking awesome. But then I went to do the same thing today, and it did not remember... Oh. Yeah, this is funny, because this is exactly where I wanted to end this episode, so it all worked out. <laughs> I didn't, I wasn't sure we'd get here, but we, we did it. You know, this episode's dragged a bit, but whatever. <laughs> alright, alright, whoa. Actually, you know, screw it, let's, um... Yeah, <laughs> I didn't think that it hit them all, but apparently my... My width of the... My circumference <laughs> was good enough. So we got another warp point here, and... There it is, there's the monster. So, shall we slay it next time? Well, I guess ultimate cliffhang. You'll have to find out. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.